Funds is an OAIS compliant asset management system for the management, publication and long-term archiving of digital resources from the humanities. It enables scholars, researchers and students to manage and publish resources from projects with permanent identification and enriched with metadata. Now this is a platform that has been developed since 2003 and it is constantly updated. We update both of the infrastructure so to be able to always be reliable and allow the findability and accessibility of the data and we update the type of content we can host into it. For example, recently we developed the possibility of hosting 3D models and 3D models are very broadly used in cultural heritage to digitize objects and share them with the public and so we can now showcase 3D virtual environment on GAMS. The GAMS provides an archive for preserving humanities research data. In one project, we collaborated with the Graz Museum to digitize postcards from Styria and publish them online. There is a lot of information you can gain from a postcard. There is the picture, dates, names, stamp, text, signature, producers, inscriptions and others. In GAMS, we created a project and encoded all this metadata, creating a structure to be able to understand their relationship and then published it online. When museums uh, uh, digitize their collections, uh, so to keep a, a digital record for internal purposes and to present them to the public. On GAMS, uh, we can present digital collections uh, of museum artifacts uh, so that these can then be organized in virtual exhibitions uh, and uh, museums can present uh, themselves to the public uh, through these platforms. Encoding the metadata means working with various technologies and formats. For example, TEI, Text Encoding Initiative, or LIDO, Lightweight Information Describing Objects. Each postcard has then a unique feature called PID, or Persistent Identifier, that relates every feature of the postcard to the specific object. Now you can build a website with an online collection of all the postcards and query them by identifier or specified characteristics for example, a metadata category, such as language. For example, if you want to take a look at all the postcards that were sent at a specific date and place, you can filter the whole collection and find specifically what you're looking for. If you are interested in a specific postcard, you can also get all the metadata that was referred to this digital object, such as pictures, descriptions, signatures, and even the XML code it was transformed in. This is all part of the FAIR data principle the GAMS is following. Data should be findable, accessible, interoperable and reusable. The GAMS provides a platform and data management system to handle all this information and make it usable for researchers and the public. Its principles and workflow make sure that the information, data and digital objects are preserved long-term so that all those components of the information system are comprehensible even after a long period of time.